Evan, what'd you find? A monster. Oh no. <laughs> That's a man eater that'll put it's you in the hospital. It's a baby anaconda right yeah. there. <laughs> Good Monday morning, everybody. Bright eyed and bushy tailed on a Monday. Had a good weekend, went to Columbia for my brother's graduation from uh, University of South Carolina. That was a pretty good time with the family. So, uh, we are out on a city violation helping landscaper Greg, aka Momentum Lawn Care, with uh, an overgrown property. So, I got uh, Munchie, Little Munchie, and I'm going to show you guys what we got. All right, so picked up the Kubota with Little Munchie this morning from the other backyard project we did on Friday, which was about 15 minutes from here, which worked perfect. You can see Greg's guys are already here cleaning up this fence line. They're getting all this cleaned up. We gotta mulch that thing. We gotta mulch that thing. They're getting some pavers, brick pavers out from around it. Uh, all these azaleas are getting mulched. And then, I can't remember if this is getting mulched. I don't remember about that. But the main thing, the big thing we gotta do here is mulch out this backyard. So we gotta come through here. I gotta get in here, mulch out all of this, go around this big tree and then work my way all the way down this line here because apparently the city's coming through to do some kind of drainage project or something through there. So I gotta come through here and try to get all that cleaned out as much as I can. So that's what we're doing. Not too much to it, just just a little mulching work on a city violation. So let's uh, get to it. Hey everybody, if you're interested in getting one of these mulchers, please contact my friends over at CCE Equipment. They're a full line dealer of Prenoff, Dennis, Seamoff, Fecon, Loftness, uh, as well as ASV and Wacker Newson Equipment. Uh, they carry a full line of stuff. Uh, they do sales, rentals, they ship nationwide. If you need anything, please look them up and uh, use the promo code IDIGIT and they will hook you up. Thanks guys. Okay, sorry about the background noise, but uh, someone had a quick question about how to adjust the auxiliary for the mulcher, for the, for the hydraulic flow. So I'm gonna just go over that really quick. I'm gonna go down to our auxiliary settings. And so that's for the thumb. I'm gonna hit enter. All right, so here's our mulcher. You can see the flow for going into the mulcher is all the way up. Flow on the two side is nothing. So we're gonna go over. And then I'm gonna start, so it's 20 gallons a minute. So I'm gonna go down, let's go down to about 10. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We'll go nine. And cause, yeah, that works. That looks about right. And then we just hit enter and we're good. And then back to our screen and we're good to go. And then we just turn the mulcher on right there and we're good to go. That's how you do it.
Evan, what'd you find? A monster. Oh no. <laughs> That's a man eater that'll put it's you in the hospital. It's a baby anaconda right yeah. there. <laughs> All right, buddy. Uh, where's a good spot for you? Probably over there. Like over there on the other side of my truck. Because we're not working over there. See, we save wildlife. This is coming along well so far. Getting through here. We got a little hairy right there coming through the bottom of that swale, but uh, made it. And uh, there's an old tree down right there. Looks like it topped over and whatever. But uh, yep, good progress. I was just gonna make an outro. Let's do it. You want to say anything to the peoples out there in YouTube land? Peoples out in YouTube land, I had fun. I love cleaning up this stuff. They're my favorite. Glad for you guys had a good time watching. Evan, Evan likes the city violations transforming properties. I do. They're awesome. The best. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice when you got a crew of guys to help you. You know, absolutely. Not a one-man army like I usually yeah, am. Yeah, well, it's way better than doing it by yourself. But all right, guys. Azalea's, Azalea's down, that backyard's cleaned up. We uh, we brought the mulch right here. All the stuff that they trimmed, just ground it all down, made a mulch pile. That's all done. Got this whole back line cleaned up. I guess the city's coming through here to do something with this as far as drainage is what Greg, landscaper Greg told me. I don't really know, but you can see how this comes down through this swale here and drains off down that way there's a big culvert over there on the other side of the driveway uh but yeah this all looks good they got all the backyard cleaned up uh they got up on the roof trimmed some of those big overhanging branches that were overhanging so this looks good everything looks good this is the perfect machine for a job like this uh these these mulchers on these excavators are just so handy for doing stuff like this save these guys a lot of time and headache in here having to go through there and do that either do that by hand or grub it out with a with a mini and then haul it all off you know they could just let me run through there that took me about an hour hour somewhere between an hour and hour and a half to from like right bro well from where i started to the end it was about an hour and a half ish or so to get all that mulch down and cleared out and then the owner wanted a little bit more of this cleaned up right here in there so we did that too and that was that so 
and then they just brought a bunch of piles of, of stuff for me to grind and that was that so i tell people a lot of time if you're getting into this business and uh you're starting off with a especially if you're starting off with a excavator with a mulcher go make friends with the landscapers especially if you're in like you know my you know kind of like you know we're here where we have a lot of brush and kudzu i mean look at that back in there that that stuff looking like that is a dime a dozen where i am that stuff you know stuff looks like that everywhere around here um you know and so make friends with the landscapers because you know they can hire you to clean all that out rather than doing it by hand uh it looks better um you know the client gets to save a little bit of money you know because this is obviously faster and more efficient so everybody wins and uh yeah so good times all right well i'm out of here for the day i'm gonna load up i gotta go get the skid steer we got some mulching i think tomorrow with the skid steer i believe i gotta go look at the job first but uh they told me it's mulchable so that's what we're planning on so i'm gonna load this thing up and we're gonna get out of here for the day so hope you guys enjoyed it i'll catch you guys tomorrow bye everybody